Hey guys, I'm Phil the Blanks. Welcome back to Let's Play Super Mario Odyssey. Look at my awesome, fashionable outfit from a random Japanese commercial from like three years ago. Kind of random. Whatever. We're in the Lake Kingdom. Uh, we took a little, a uh, little pit stop, I guess, to buy some things. Um, I don't have enough money to get the um, the outfit they kind of want me to have to get a Power Moon, so I figured it'll just continue on and do some stuff. Uh, and then, oh, I can climb on this. Anything here? Nope. Okay. Uh, and you're looking at that, yeah, you're looking at the dress, and that you can tell there's a moon on that dress, and I can't get in there right now. Um, yeah, so I'll find some, um, some purple coins, that way I'll be able to buy the entire outfit and get into the locked door. So, um, what now, I guess? I guess we'll just leave. Get some coins first. Do 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 do. Did you ever talk to you? Yeah, you just told me to go up there, forgetting what I was doing last time. Oh, those coins are still there. Nice. I will take some time to get some more coins. Thank you. Aha. I like how um, coins do come back, obviously, because coins are huge in this game. All right, so we're still missing two of the moon shards around here, and uh, oh, there's a uh, there's Dory, and there's a moon shard. I'll get that first. But yeah, it's Dory from friggin' or Tessie. I forgot the name. Uh, from Super Mario 64 and other Mario games now, and you have a moon for us. Well, thank you. Can I get you? Nope. Oh, sorry. Oh, you're too cute. I just find it's funny that she's wearing a hat, and it's like, maybe I can knock it off and become her, but I guess I can't. Um, yep, up we go. So, I haven't been to the surface around here yet. There's nothing really much, it looks like. I do like how the island bobs, though. That's kind of cool. All right, well, let's look around. This is the map here. So, we started over here, and, uh, oh, so we actually made our way to where the Brutals are, kind of. I didn't realize that that underwater palace that we were in uh, last episode would lead us here. That's kind of cool. Oh, there's the last shard. Okay, perfect. Who put this rock here? I don't know. But I can't do anything with it. I'm assuming it's after I do all the plot moons, it'll disappear. Because that, that's what it seems to be. That not everything is unlockable if, until you do all the plot moons. Like, I've noticed that uh, with Tostarina and the Sand Kingdom, like, now there's no ice everywhere. So, things like that. How the hell do I get up here? Um, no, I can't do weird, like, triangle jump things. I can do that. That's good. Bam. Now, where is it going to pop up? Oh, right at the entrance. That, that makes sense, actually. I guess I could... <sighs> I just noticed that that top, kind of out of window, I could have just done that. Come here. Cheep, cheep. There we go. Love the cheep, cheep. He's adorable. I can get in up there, can I? Well, I'm going to get the, uh, in first. Just drop all the way down. And... Power Moon. How many do I have already in this level? I got one, two, three, four, five, six, ten! Ten Power Moons! Ah, ah, ah. And I see that there's another weird water elevator there. I did not get to this uh, top area here, did I? Whoop. Come on. There we go. Get to the roof through that shaft. Thank you. Oh, coins. Coins leading the way. Doing, doing, doing. And, oh, and a traditional, like, power uh, P-switch. Cool. Okay, so it just opens that. Not a big deal. Anything around here before I do that, though? Nope. Nothing here on the other side? Oh, at least there's some uh, coinage. Ah, damn. I always screw up those ten coin blocks. Oh, well, whatever. Let's get in there. Up we go. Oh, ah, but I want those. Oh, I, I can get up there anytime I want, so I'll just come here and get those first. There we are. Enter back through here. Woo! So cool. And that means I can now buy the uh, the rest of the underwater outfit. And I'll change and do that. But I'll probably uh, end up going back to my other outfit. I, I It's cute and funny and silly, but I, I don't want to wear snorkels in a, in a big tube. I don't know. It just looks dumb. How do I look? How do I look? Yeah, see, that's better. I like just like that. But I can go to the closet over here and uh, change the rest of the outfit. I do like how you can put any combination. You're not stuck on a specific combo. You know what I mean? Like, I can I can use the regular Mario hat if I wanted to and with the scuba diving outfit and things like that. Pretty nifty. Do, do, do. I do like the sound effect of me walking, though. Don't know if you can hear it, but yeah. All right, let me in. Yep, probably look ready to swim. Please go inside. Thank you. Oh, that was dumb. 
And you bring me here. And this is where the moon is. Well, I don't need to swim in here, so why would I have needed to get the friggin' outfit? Oh. Just the Jax's tail. Gotta hold that down. And power moon. There we go. Come here. But yeah, it's like, oh, you're look like you're ready to swim. Not that it needed to. Yeah, I feel underdressed. Exactly. And all right, I'm gonna go back and change. Yeah, enjoy my visit. Pfft, whatever. Even my nice, fashionable outfit back. It's better on me, anyways. Doink, doink, doink. There we go. I do like how the baseball cap kind of looks like Ness's hat from Earthbound. But I mean, I guess it's just a regular baseball hat. Just the colors, I guess. The, the red and blue. All right, so I guess we'll go back up there. Um, and I'm sure, certain that up there will be where the Brutals are, so... Um, I guess I get to swim from here. Do, 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 up we go. Back in here, and then through that little tube again. Whew. Get more coins. Why not? I guess I could buy the Boxer outfit now, but I'm not going to. I will later. I, I don't want to spend all my money on just that one thing yet. Oh, it's a coin engine. I can see the ship up there, so that's kind of cool. What do you do? Oh, okay, that helps. <laughs> that helps a lot, actually. Then I don't have to climb up to get it. There's a pipe over there, too. Oh, there's so much to do. There you go. Give me that coin. 90 out of 50. Not doing super great for coins so far, but whatever. I mean, just starting... Ah, there we go. Here's a moon. Yay! Oh, jeez. Okay, bye. Frig. Some moons are really, like... F like, they really want to get away from you. They're like, nope. Don't want nothing to do with you. Playing hard to get. I gotta go chase him. Coinage. And... Oh, a zipper. Yeah, grab that. Oh, damn it. Come on, upwards. Nope. Shake and shake again, Phil. Oh, cool. I actually, like, threw it upwards. That's kind of cool. And... Oh, coins. Nice. Hey, purple coins are always great, so I'm not gonna complain. Just gonna go all the way over there, get that moon... Bam. Oh. Woo! What's in the box? What's in the box? I've never seen that movie. What was that? I think that's seven. Is it seven? Yeah, I think it's seven. I think. I, I don't want to say what happens because in case someone didn't see seven. I haven't seen seven, but I actually know what happens. Um, and I'm pretty sure when it happens at the end of the movie, he's yelling out, like, what's in the box? And uh, we got a guy at work. He's a weirdo. Um, whenever a box comes in, you'll just hear him, What's in the box? And I was like, okay. <laughs> um, this is a weird area. I like that little, I don't know. You guys can probably see it. When I'm on the ground there, uh, like, the ground ripples. It's kind of cool. Yay, purple coins. I love how I was like, Oh, I'm not doing super great for purple coins. Now I'm halfway there, so. Ah, oh, shit. Just missed that big block of cheddar cheese. Mmm, cheddar cheese. I like cheddar cheese. I like mozzarella better. I love Monterey Jack. Question of the day. What's your favorite cheese? It's a good question of the day, if I do say so myself. Um, I don't know. I, I like I like jalapeno habanero. Uh, hab no, hab jalapeno habanero. Jalapeno, um... Oh, damn. What is it? Shit. It's like a white cheese. It's got jalapeno in it. Oh, whatever. It's. I mean, that's not technically a type of cheese. That's just cheese with stuff in it. Which is fine by me. I like cheese with hot stuff in it. Um, but whatever. I, I like Monterey Jack. It's good stuff. Damn, what is that? Havarti? Man, this isn't Gouda. I can't remember at all. <laughs> Sorry, I know you guys can unbear my puns. I've got way too many cheese puns for, for a random guy, to be honest. That's kind of scary. Alright, Power Moon. It's like my 13th free... Yeah, 13 ones. Pretty good, because there I'm just kind of wandering around. I haven't even done a single plot moon here yet. Though this this level doesn't seem too big. I didn't even see how many moons there are. Whatever, it's a surprise. It's fun. So, more coins. So, I'm guessing... Oh, you can hear the brutal theme. It's kind of in the background. Smoke. So, I'm guessing that like, the size and scope of each kingdom is based on how many coins they have. So, there's 50 in this one, which is, you know, fair amount. But, I'm assuming, like... There's, there's a hundred in Toast Arena. So far, it's the only kingdom with a hundred, because it's huge. Alright, who am I fighting? Oh, probably, um, the big guy. Tall guy, because he's talking. 
Ah, uh, even matches the boss's tuxedos. No way we're giving it back. Alright, Cletus. Oh, he's got the little hair. <laughs> I don't know why, but he reminds me of Goofy. Like, from Mickey Mouse. I don't know why. Maybe because he's just taller than everyone else. Ow. Ah, shit. Yeah, that, that, that. I don't like the straw hat with the saw. I don't like it. Okay, can't hit him just normally. Uh, shit. Ah, oh, Frig. So I gotta hit his hat. Boink. There we go. It makes a little flower. You know, if he took away the flower, I probably wouldn't be tall enough to... Ah, shit. Nah, that sucks. I like his little dance, too. Then, I like the idea that he's like... He's either trying to cover his head or he's like looking for me. Like making little binoculars with his, uh, with his hands. I don't know. I can see the Odyssey. I can see the Odyssey from here. Alright, come on. Don't hit me. I don't want to fight you again. Come on. Yes, there we go. Boing. Right on your fat head. Well, actually, your head's not that fat. It's pretty tall, though. Boom. Pop. And there's my multi-moon. Ooh, I like the pink multi-moon. It looks really nice. Yay, multi-moon! I got a multi-moon with my ghost friend. <laughs> yeah, I'm singing the exact same song I was singing like a couple episodes ago. Probably because I was just like editing it. Awesome. Awesome, awesome. Whee! Alright, so what is the next... Um... Okay, well actually it looks like we went back to the Odyssey. Is that the only plot moon here? There's gotta be another. No! Really? So, so, so far, this is the only level I've been at that only has a single plot moon. There's a hint toad again. That's really weird. Yeah, I know we collected enough power moves, but I just find that odd. I guess this is just a tiny level. I mean, that's okay. Like, not every level has to be huge. I just find it really weird. Like, there could have been, like, a, a plot moon inside the, the palace ocean that I was at. Maybe I already got it, and that's why? No, that... I mean... Maybe? Like, this is a game where it looks like you can sequence break pretty heavily, so maybe... Maybe that's it? I really don't know. Oh, whatever. Keep going, I guess. Um, I don't want to leave just yet, though. Um, go up the stairs. I think the stairs are fixed. Oh, the stairs... I couldn't have gone up that way anyways. Uh, take a picture of Hindart. Uh, okay. Uh, there's that button on the Joy-Con. There you are. Huh. So I guess if I go back to the Cascade Kingdom, there'll be a thing there, I guess? I don't know. Anyways, I'm gonna explore regardless. Um, oh, jeez, they got little veils. Uh, and a Lakitu's fishing. Ah, oh, I should've killed one. Uh, but I'm gonna explore uh, for the rest of this episode. Uh, we won't leave uh, this kingdom until the end of the episode. Come here, Lakitu. I wanna do something with you. Alright. Lower and raise... Oh! There's a painting. Can I fish it out? Hello? Nope. Okay. But I do see these, like, sandy guys. Hello? Come on. Come on. Oh, he disappeared. Should I get them all to be... Oh, he's back. What the hell do I do? I'll be really honest. I hate fishing games in, in video games. Fishing is, like, the only game that I found out a fun fishing game was Link's Awakening. That was it. I don't like fishing games. Yeah, nothing's happening here. Try for a couple more seconds. I don't know. Yeah, screw this. Oh, well, painting it is. And enter the painting. Uh, this looks like... Yeah, it's going back to Toast Arena. So that one painting I found in Toast Arena brought me to Metro Kingdom in New Donk City. So this is probably just going to bring me someplace I couldn't get to without getting this picture. Yeah, so there's no way I could have gotten up here. Though there is... I guess this is cool, because that means... Um, I can always get back up here by traversing um, through the menu. Because you can warp to each of your uh, each of those flags. Come here. I want all this. No, oh, I was hoping to get all the coins would activate another moon. Alright, back we go, I guess. Back to friggin' Lake Kingdom. Huh. There's still that um, canvas in Cascade, uh, Cascade Kingdom. The first one I found, it was empty. Which is weird. Alright, up we go. Time to kill me, Goomba. Nope, that's the wrong button. Shit, shit. Oh, that was close. All right. Um, can I... Ah, oh, frick. That's a lot of... No, I, I can't, I guess. I don't know. Maybe I can? 
Shit. Oh, shake the Joy-Con. There we go. Uh, that's all of them? Oh, one more. Come here, you. Boink. So is that like a girl Goomba? Or should I not assume gender here? So what's the point of this? What's the point of this giant Goomba stack that I have? Oh, whatever. It's gonna kill me too, isn't it? Yep. Oh. Oh, nice. Yeah, I need that. Shit, shit, shit. Ah, good. Oh, it only gives you one. For some reason, I thought it would have filled me up. Oh, oh, the zipper. Love me my zippers. Whee! Love the sound. <laughs> so the long zippers just sound that much better. Because you get the you get the sound to go on for a while. Whee! Coins! And power moon, of course. That is my 17th power moon here. Wow. So when we go back to the Odyssey, it's going to go like... The it's like my favorite part. It's when you get a ton of moons and you put it in the Odyssey. You just get to see it all get blended up in that little weird contraption. I guess I can still fool around for a little bit longer. I'm only about 15 minutes in. Oh, there's a scarecrow, I think? There was a scarecrow in um, Toastarina, but he was in ice. So what the hell? Okay. Um, I guess I'll jump in here. What does that do? Oh! Uh, marks a moon. So it's like a time trial of some sort. That's kind of cool. Yeah, Lake Kingdom Timer Challenge 1. Cool! Alright. I'm okay with that. I figured this game would have like time trials of some sort. Who knows? There might be even be a Koopa the Quick Race. Like there was in Mario 64. Or maybe, um... What is his name? El Pianta or whatever? Uh, from Mario Sunshine will pop up. What do you want? You're in a weird little area. Those fish in their little round bars are cute, but I'm too nervous to approach one. Is there anything in here? Oh, it's it's oh it's sealed off. Well, she wants to see a fish. She wants to see a cheap cheap. I'll go get her a cheap cheap. Easy enough. Cheap cheeps, come here. Come on, not close enough. There we go. All right, cheap cheap. Time to make a woman happy. And if there's anything that Phil can teach you, it's how to do that. All you gotta do is wriggle into her hole. Ha <laughs> ha! That's a disgusting joke. So yeah, uh, guess I got a power moon for that. Bam! Yay! I met a lake cheap cheap. Okay. I met a lake cheap cheap. That just sounds like a very. Is that like a reference to something? Unless there's other power moons in the game where like, oh, I, I want to meet a Koopa Troopa, and then you gotta do that, and it's like, I met a something Koopa Troopa. I don't know. Maybe that's just the name of. That series of power moons. It's a pretty small little area, but it, there's a lot... I was surprised at how much there was to do, considering how tiny this area actually is. I guess explore over here a little bit. Oh, first I want to kill these guys, damn it. Come on, I want to get all of them in just one go. Yeah, aww. Oh, I get the rest of them. Yeah, so much fun. Oh, and there's a zipper here. I must have forgot that. And say, I'll get these, though, first. Nice. But yeah, I don't think I saw this before, did I? Oh, come on. Aim a little bit better. Oh, oh. There we go. And what's up here? This doesn't look familiar at all. Oh, coins. Nice. 33 coins. Doing pretty good. Ow. Get up there. Oh, this looks weird. Oh, jeez, okay. The flower, and something up here. What are you? What an odd stone, yeah. Should I, like, what, is, what the hell is this? Ground pound it? No. What is this? Stone is sort of peculiar, but doesn't need to do anything. Alright, well, I guess that's video game speak for come back another time. Alright, I guess let's get going. Um... Load up. Ozzy needs eight more. We got way more than eight. How many do we get? And... So fun. 33, two. Oh, did we fill it all up? Yeah, because we said we only need eight more. 33, two. 52. 19 moons. Damn. Awesome. Awesome, awesome. So I guess that means we're going to... What was it? it was it the, It was the Wooded Kingdom, I think, right? Here's the Wooded Kingdom now. Well, I was could. I guess I could have just gone back. Oh, no, it, it doesn't give me that weird second option. Oh, well, Wooded Kingdom, here we come. And then when we land, we'll call it an episode. 
Goodbye, Lake Kingdom viewers. Surprisingly small, but a lot of fun. I do know there is another water level in this game, so that's probably why uh, Lake Kingdom's a bit smaller. I mean, that's kind of cool. I mean, just make a little playground area, really. What's fun is that, like, you, anyone could design one of those. As long as you're smart about it, you design a little, a small little area, give it lots to do, and there you go. You made a Mario Odyssey level. Uh, whoever heard of a wedding with stolen dress? Let's go out after that tactless fiend. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's look at our skills. Don't care. I already know that. Wood Kingdom. According to this guy, there's a giant greenhouse with flowers. It's famous with beautiful soiree bouquet. So, yeah, again, something that has to do with, uh, with the wedding. I like how every level has something wedding-wise. It's the Wooded Kingdom. Steam Gardens. Wow, it's very cool. Very unlike Mario, too. All right. Well, with that, I'm filling the blanks, and I'll see you guys. Oh, all right. I forgot we got to do this. Road to Sky Garden. Ba -da -ba -da. And it's inside, I guess, that giant prana plant. And do you have anything to say, Cappy? Nope. All right. Well, I'm filling the blanks. I'll see you guys next time. Take care. I don't. Do you, shut up, Cappy.